guys, how are you? So I am here, it's Saturday morning, and I just received um, this in the mail from Dr. Jart, and it's called their Sikapare Tiger Grass Color Correcting Treatment. And lately, I've been trying to make a little bit more effort on my Instagram stories to kind of debox things as I'm receiving them because as you know, working in beauty, um, I get a lot of products to try, which I'm so grateful for. Um, and so I've been showing you guys along the way what I've been getting and kind of doing like mini reviews. And for this pr product in particular, I had done a little survey to ask you guys if you wanted to see a video on it and the answer was yes. So um, this will be really quick obviously because I'm just going to show you what this looks like on um, and why it's great. So as you can see, no makeup, um, knock on wood because I'm blemish free right now. Any of the spots that you're seeing on my skin, so what happens with me is any breakouts, I hold on to like any of the spots for quite some time after the blemish is already gone. That's probably my biggest pet peeve with my skin. Um, and then also, I'm starting to show through um, some sunspots, which is the joy of being in my 30s. Um, so the real, there's a couple ways to combat it, but um, that's kind of getting more into talking about some skincare options. But for makeup, um, this is a great option. So it's color correcting. So when you look at the actual product, it's um, it's green. So on the color wheel, in the world of color, um, green cancels out red. And so that's what this is really great for. This is great for anyone that has rosacea, acne spots, um, blemishes, irritation. Um, and the story behind it is that the Asian tigers would um, rub their bodies around in the tiger in the tiger grass and that was soothing and so that's one of the main ingredients in this product um, it has an SPF 30 and um, it has like a dust filter basically that protects yourself from getting any like dust on your skin after you have it on um, and it neutralizes all of your redness so you can wear this by itself um, just as your base or you can wear it under makeup if you want to use it as a primer I'm huge with anything that it has to have at least SPF 30 for me so as long as I'm having like a pretty good skin um, lately I've just been wearing this and then I just touch up a little bit more with concealer as needed so that's kind of the skinny on this it's amazing it feels really good I love the finish um, I'm just going to quickly put it on so that you guys can see um, what it looks like going on because that was the surprise to me the first time. Um, so my hands are clean. I just uh, dipped my finger into the jar. That's about how much product that you would need. And I'm just putting it on straight on my skin in circular motions. Um, so it has zinc in it and that's why when I first put it on I was like, oh great. because my skin looked so white um, but what's crazy is that once you start uh, blending this in it turns basically into your exact skin tone which is amazing but meanwhile it cancels out all the redness so I like to first just kind of get a good base layer on everywhere and just really 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 blend it in Okay, so you can see how beautiful that finish is. It just took down some of that redness and irritation and it just feels really, really nice on the skin. I always put this on um, just before I'm going to leave the house because I, I'm a huge believer in always wearing SPF um, or you know before the gym, anything like that, I always put something on. So for me, what I would do now just to kind of finish my skin for the day, um, I love and I use all the time from Giorgio Armani the um, the High Precision Retouch Concealer. So, and I just use like a little blending brush. I'm sure this is made for eyeshadow, but I love it for concealer. So I just put a little bit onto my hand and I'm just going to kind of brighten and conceal um, areas that need just a little bit more attention. So that's kind of the beauty of makeup is you can get your base on and then you can go in and layer a little bit more just where you need it so you don't feel like you have to have a huge thick coat of makeup on. 
that's usually, I always feel my best the less amount of makeup I have to have on my skin. So I'm just buffing that in and then I'm going to take it and just kind of spot treat anything that needs a little bit more. And I just kind of gently tap it in and then I'll leave it and then I'll go back and see if it needs any more little layers. But that seems to be what works the best for me. Okay, and that is it. So that's an easy, quick way to use this to even out your skin tone and kind of just give a really nice light base and then spot treat and conceal anything else that needs just a little bit more coverage and the finish is just nice and natural and glowing and easy so i hope that helps um, for you guys and your skin and i totally totally recommend this product um, and then of course like if you need more coverage or you like the feeling of like a flawless foundation finish use this underneath it's a great base underneath foundation so it's kind of a two for one you can take it easy and just wear it by itself or also use it as a primer so yes to dr. Jart um, yes to the tried and true Armani I love it um, and I hope you guys have a great day I'll see you soon bye